This match is for the national U.S. title. The first one to come out is... I wonder who it is. The Terror! There he is. With his long hair and everything. I think I scaled my elbow. But whatever. And the second person coming out is the champion, the national U.S. champion, of course, is Dread Venom! National U.S. Champion, Impartial Tag Champion. There he is. Entering the ring as we speak. This foam tube. There he is. <laughs> well, he keeps the song on for the pose and the camera gets turned away. Oh, I'm sorry. Alright, um, okay. Okay, um, let's kind of start now. He's taking off his dog tags. Actually, I'll come over here. Here's a better spot. There is our champion, Dead Venom. Holy shit! Hits the terror in the leg with it. Hits him on the hand. As the terror delivers a crushing kick to Dread Venom's leg. Oh my god! Oh, oh. Uh, Dread Venom. Received an injury today in study hall, and fucking, you know, oh, he punches the terror in the stomach. Trading blows. Not really trading. I don't know what that was. Shoulder block, I think. Um, oh, nice. Nice. Sternum crushing. <laughs> Dread Venom, yeah, as I said, suffered a horrible injury in study hall where he tried to do something and, you know, cut his leg open. Shin. Shin. So which really hurts. Which really hurts, apparently. Which I think may give the Terran advantage in this match. Another advantage, besides his tallness and shit. Oh, tries to lift him up against the knee to the stomach and multiple forearms to the back. Tries picking him back up. And he spins him off to the side, and I don't know what the hell that was. I think it was an attempted suplex. That hurt my back. Okay. Really? It's not good. You gonna stand there? Stand there. Kick him. Oh. Oh. Delivering multiple kicks to the side of the prank. Oh. And hits him in the back with his own kendo stick. Oh, hits him on the ass with it now. Right onto the butt cheeks. I don't think Dreadnought is going to be able to poop for the next six weeks. Oh, he gives him a stun gun on the second rope. And gets the barbed wire bat and hits him right on the back. Right on the back. Putting there's a special weapon, I might add. He's delivering the fight outside of the ring. He slams both of those trash can lids onto the head of the terror. Throws him back in the ring. I like jumping. Clothesline. Doesn't really phase the terror. Another kick to the leg. Trying to wear down the base of the Dread Venom. And a DET. Ten. A kick out at two. Oh. Dread Venom wearily getting back up. The terror. Grabbing a steel chair and hoisting it to the ring. God damn it. Oh, he hits him on the side with that metal thing. Oh, he hits him on the head with a steel chair and Dread Venom drops to the canvas. Ah! 
an arm submission for the terror weakening those arms of the dead venom. He punches it in a minute. The terror once again getting out of the ring, maybe to get a weapon or so, or two, whatever. Holy shit! I think he slept. The Frank, I mean, Dread Venom hobbles over and throws a trash can lid right at the head of the terror. As he hops and hobbles out of the ring, the terror stays in and chucks the trash can lid at him. How ironic this situation is. Oh, tries hitting the head of the title belt, hits him on the back with it. We continue this fight elsewhere. Hits him on the head with a water bottle. A water bottle that wasn't frozen. Hits him on the arm with it. Leave his stomach. Oh, throws him up against the shed. There we go. 